and I'm back with the final video of what she bought now. <laughs> so this is the uh, last item that I bought from the selection that I showed you at the start of this little thing. And it is the Make It Mini Food Kit Series 2. I've done loads of these in the past, they're all on my YouTube. Um, let's hope we haven't got any duplicates, eh? But I absolutely love these sets, they're so much fun. Right, let's see what we can do. start with the utensils. So we have got the little nib that goes on top of the little thing that we never use. We've got some tongs. And what's this in here I see? It's a little spoon. It's so small. There we go. Let's go for this one first, shall we? Oh, we've got a little plate and a little cup. Do you know what? I think I know which one this is already. And I have a feeling it's the churros. Shall we see if we're right? It's the churros. Oh, these are so flipping cute. Look at these. Let's open these up and have a quick look. Oh, my God. Aren't they the cutest little things? Oh. They proper look like they should be full on edible. Oh, and they're flexible. Obsessed, obsessed, obsessed. What are we going to do? I think we're going to have three of them like that. We'll have one in the cup. Shall we? Like it's been dunked in. Oh, because we haven't even opened everything yet. I just got really excited for the fact that it's the churros and I've seen this before. And there's the chocolate spread. Oh my god, it's adorable. So, churros. I love this. We're doing this. This is happening. 100% this is happening. Uh, so, we're going to dip the churros in the pot, put the churros on the plate, fill up the cup, and set it. So, let me get my uh, UV light out. We'll go from there. Chocolate pot is so adorable. Right, first things first, I guess we're going to work out how we want this. Because I always make this mistake, I get overexcited and I never know how I want to do it. I love, I love, I love, love how they've done this. With the, the churro sticking up. And I'm going to have a go at seeing if we can get it like that. Um, so if I take these off the plate, what I want to do first is stick two on the plate. With a third one on top, like that ish. So, what I'm going to do is actually set these to the plate a bit at a time because I'm terrible for just putting everything in at once. Absolutely terrible. We've also got the little spoon. I might leave the spoon on the side as well, but look how rich that chocolate is. Oh, gorgeous. Almost edible, isn't it? Right, so we've got our chocolate. I'm I'm just going to take a little bit of it, just like that for now, and I'm just going to pop it on the plate. And this is purely, purely so I can stick the first two down. And I might need just a little bit more than that. Like I say, it's just to stick these two down, so I've got a starting point. So I'm going to put them like that. I'm going to maybe even 
push them off the edge of the plate a little bit and then I'm just going to set that so nothing's going to move. Let's move everything else out of the way. Right, we've got these in place now. I'm just going to pop the cup on, which really I should have done when I was doing that, but never mind. We can do it a bit at a time, couldn't we? So again, I'm just going to put a bit on the base and use this to stick the cup into place. I think I'm going to put it about there-ish. And then we're going to take another churro I'm just going to dunk it straight in the pot. Like so. And then that's just going to go on top of there. And then I'm just going to set this again so we're not making a mess of everything. Let's make sure we've got it exactly how we want it. I kind of want it a bit more that way. There we go. And while we're here, we might as well fill up the cup as well. So I'm now going to do that. This is not the easiest utensil to use, but hey-ho. Okay, let's just get that set in place and then we can move on. Okay, and we're pretty much set. Um, I've been thinking about how best to do this. Uh, are you set? Almost. I've been thinking how best to do this churro and I'm thinking if I can dip it in, hold it up and set it while I'm holding it, I might have an, a way of doing it. If not, we might just be giving up on life. Uh, so I'm just going to grab a chunk of this stuff, like that. Try and hold this. There you go. And then I'm just going to quickly set it while I'm holding it. Okay, so what I've done is I've filled the cup up a bit more just to stabilise the base of that bit of string I've made. Popped a little bit more chocolate on here so it's running down over the other ones a bit more. And then I'm just going to pop the spoon in front, I think, with the chocolate still on it like that, as a bit of a, a side thing. So, there you have it. I've barely used any of the chocolate, actually. I'm just going to pop the lid back on that one. Let's do a final setting place and see how it looks. And we are all set. Let's have a look at how cute this thing came out. I decided to set the chocolate in the pot as well so I could keep the little pot without it going everywhere. It's still a bit gooey, but I'll continue setting that at another time. So, as is looking, it's this hardened up, it has. Check out that cute little thing. Oh my god, I love it. I've got the chocolate dripping down the pot. The churro came out perfect. Very happy with that. I love this, love how this comes out. It's still got flexibility in it as well with it only being stuck on that one point. Um, but yeah, there's that side. There's that side. Is that not the cutest little set ever? I love it. I absolutely love it. What a cool little buy. Always recommend these. I've got so many of them in the window. Um, in fact, let's go put this in the window and I can show you. And there we go, he's in the window now. And these are all the other little, the uh, cute little sets. I've got candles back there. Um, Dory in a bowl. All the little the components you get. But yeah. Absolutely adorable. So all of these are on my YouTube anyway. And I'm bound to get more at some point, but I think that's my favourite one so far. Thanks for watching guys. See you soon. Much loves.